Hey guys, Colton Tackett on Sonic and OKKO OK Fanatic 2020 here, and you're here for another video, so, you know, I got this tape in the mail, and it's a 1994 Chevrolet Camaro audio cassette. Now, I think this tape's from 1994, I mean, I think it said, like, on side one it said, introduction to your new vehicle, and side two said, selected options and features, so, it must be the 1994 Chevrolet Camaro, so yeah. This tape is from 1994, actually. I mean, forgive me if I'm wrong on that. I mean, I'm just trying to think it is, so... I'm trying to wonder if this... If the background music's gonna be the same for this tape, so... I'll try to play it and see what we get. Oh, by the way, the... If you're looking at the audio cassette art, it looks pretty different, doesn't it? I mean, I never saw it look like that, but that's awesome. So, with that being said, viewers, it's time to play the tape, so... Let's get ready for the introduction to your new vehicle, so... Play it in three, two, one. Okay. Set it just in case. Oh, this is the same. Okay. Congratulations on your purchase of a 1994 Camaro. It is 1994. Welcome to the Chevrolet family. I was right. Your new Camaro is a breed apart, descended from the original sport coupe legend. Whether you've selected a Camaro or a Z28, a coupe or a convertible, your Camaro delivers the performance, style, and reliability you expect from a Chevrolet. Over the next few minutes, we'll discuss Camaro's features and controls. For best results, we recommend you park and follow along. Remember, this is just an overview. Yes, it is. For more detailed explanations, please see your owner's manual. Now, let's get started. Camaro's sporty exterior styling won't go unnoticed. A distinctive front panel and stylish air dam incorporates halogen headlamps and a small grille. Flush-mounted door handles and windshield and dual sport mirrors all add to Camaro's bold profile. The exterior design is practical as well. Lightweight composite polymer body panels and polyurea fenders and front bumper fascia will resist dings, dents, and rust. A base coat clear coat paint treatment helps keep your Camaro looking showroom new and protects against the elements. Up front, standard composite halogen headlamps show the way and standard solar glass on all windows except T-tops offers outstanding UV protection, enhancing interior fabric life. Camaro's standard 3.4 liter sequential fuel injected V6 engine delivers 160 horsepower and 200 foot-pounds of torque for outstanding performance. Z28 models feature a mighty sequential fuel injected 5.7 liter V8 LT1 engine the LT1 puts 275 horsepower and 325 foot-pounds of torque at your command. Power for the most enthusiastic driving. Rack and pinion power steering, short long arm front suspension, and torque arm track bar rear suspension combine to give you firm control of the road. The standard front disc and rear drum brakes on Camaro or four-wheel disc brakes on Z28 provide smooth responsive stops. The standard anti-lock brake system, also known as ABS, can slow or stop you more effectively than a conventional power brake system while maintaining steering capability. Your Camaro may be equipped with a four-speed automatic transmission with electronic shift control. Your Camaro may be equipped with a five-speed manual transmission. If you have a Z28, it may be equipped with a six-speed manual transmission with the skip shift feature. Z28 models offer another performance benefit with a standard limited slip differential. This feature locks the differential to send equal torque to both rear wheels, increasing traction. Your new Camaro has a host of passenger protection and security features which use the latest technology. If you have an automatic transmission, a brake transmission shift interlock helps prevent unintentional shifting from park. Your foot must be on the brake pedal to move the shift lever from the park position. Front and rear seat passengers buckle up with three-point lap and shoulder belts. All lap and shoulder belts are designed to be child seat compatible. In addition to lap and shoulder belts for all passengers, Camaro features a standard driver and front passenger supplemental restraint system. 
The airbags are designed to protect the driver and front passenger in the event of a frontal collision of sufficient impact energy. Please remember, you must use your lap and shoulder belts. Camaro has a state-of-the-art security system called Passkey 2. This system allows your car to be started only by an ignition key embedded with a correctly coated pellet. Duplicate ignition keys may be obtained from a Chevrolet dealer. Many locksmiths can also provide duplicates. Passkey 2 may make you eligible for certain insurance discounts. Ask your agent for details. Studies have shown that insurance rates on Camaros vary widely from company to company. Mind blown. If they pay to shop around. Camaro's interior has been planned with your every need in mind. Everything from the cargo area to the instrument panel has been designed for your comfort and convenience. A lift-up armrest on the center console has a lighted storage area for maps, gloves, or anything you need to stow. There's also a lighted glove box on the instrument panel and smaller storage areas at the front of the console and in the door panels. At the front of the console is a switch for the power top if you have a convertible model. Camaro's rear seat folds down for extra cargo space and the rear compartment closeout panel will keep cargo from view. The closeout panel also acts as a sound barrier to road noise from the rear when in the up position. An optional remote hatch or a trunk release is located in the glove box for your convenience. Your rearview mirror has individually controlled driver and passenger side reading lamps. When you open a door, the reading lamps, as well as the dome lamp, come on to light the passenger compartment and cargo area. Your driver's seat has four-way manual adjust, unless you have the optional six-way power seat. Use the two levers at the front of the cushion to adjust the seat. The left lever controls fore aft movement, while the right one tilts the cushion for added thigh support. If you have the six-way power driver's seat, the control pod is on the left side of the driver's seat cushion. The controls allow you to tilt the seat cushion or move the entire seat forward, backward, up, or down. You can also adjust the angle of the seat back. On the outboard side of each seat cushion toward the back is a long handle. Pull this lever up lean back and you can recline the seat your seats door panels floor mats and carpeting have been treated with scotch guard fabric protector this makes food spills and other little messes a lot easier to clean up and also helps your upholstery look new longer tilt steering lets you position your steering wheel to the position that's most comfortable to adjust the tilt steering wheel pull the smaller lever on the left side of the steering column toward you Move the wheel into position and release the lever. Your controls and gauges link you to the operation of your new Camaro. Several important features are controlled by the larger lever on the left side of the steering column. When your lights are on, pulling straight back on this lever will turn on your high or low beam headlamps. Your windshield wiper controls are also on this lever. Turn the switch at the end of the lever to control your standard pulse control windshield wipers. You can adjust wiper speed from a 16-second delay between sweeps up to normal low and high speeds. Turn the switch in the opposite direction for a single wipe cycle. To use the windshield washer, push forward on the paddle at the top of the switch. Washer solvent will spray until you release the paddle. Once the paddle is released, the wiper arm will make a few more sweeps and stop automatically. If your Camaro is equipped with cruise control, the switch is at the end of this lever. To set cruise control, accelerate to your desired speed and move the switch to on. Push the button at the end of the lever, release the button and take your foot off the accelerator. To disengage cruise control, step lightly on the brake pedal or clutch pedal if you have a manual transmission. Or move the cruise switch to off. Your cruise control also has speed resume, increase and decrease functions. For details, see your owner's manual. To the left of the steering column is the headlamp and instrument panel light control panel. Move the thumb switch upwards to brighten your instrument panel lights. Move the dial all the way up until it clicks to turn on the reading and dome courtesy lamps. Next to the thumb switch is the headlamp control knob. Turn the knob to P to turn on just the parking lamps. Turn the knob all the way to the light symbol to turn on the headlamps and the parking lamps. 
If you have fog lamps, the button on the right of the light control panel will turn them on, provided your low beam headlamps or parking lamps are also on. At the center of the instrument panel are the heating and ventilation controls. Rotate the fan control dial to select your desired fan speed. Rotate the temperature control dial to the blue for cooler temperatures to the red for warmer air. The airflow dial directs incoming air to various outlets as indicated by the various symbols. Rotate the dial to the vent symbol to send air through the vents in the center of the instrument panel. Select the floor symbol to direct most of the air to the floor and side window defoggers. Rotate the dial to the windshield defrost symbol and most of the air will be sent to the windshield. If your Camaro is equipped with available air conditioning, the airflow dial has two additional positions, max and AC. The AC compressor is activated in these positions and in the defrost position when the temperature control is in the blue area. If you have the available rear window defogger, pressing the button just right of the steering column will activate it. If you have available power windows, the controls are on the front armrest control pads. On the driver's side door, the left-hand switch controls the driver's side window, and the right-hand switch controls the passenger side window. With power windows, the driver's window is equipped with an express down feature. This feature lets you open the driver's window completely by just pressing and holding the control button for about a third of a second. You don't need to hold the button. Stop the window partway down by pressing the button again and then releasing. If you have remote power sport mirrors, the control is at the front of the driver's door panel armrest. To adjust the driver's side mirror, rotate the knob to the left, then use the joystick to adjust the mirror. To adjust the passenger side mirror, rotate the knob to the right, then use the joystick. If you have available power door locks, the controls are on the door panel armrests. To lock the doors, Press the side of the button marked with a door symbol. Press the other side of the button to unlock them. Camaro's power door locks incorporate a new feature called retained accessory power. This feature allows you to operate some interior accessories for about 10 minutes after the ignition is turned off or until a door is opened. Once a door is opened, power to the radio and windows will shut off and remain off until you turn on the ignition. The power locks, mirrors, and hatch release will only operate for about 35 seconds after you shut the door. After this time, these accessories will not operate until a door is opened or you turn on the ignition. Retained accessory power is a great safety, convenience, and security feature. Your Camaro may be equipped with remote keyless entry. This feature allows you to unlock the driver's door, both doors, or the trunk or hatch from a control on your key ring as you approach your vehicle. This eliminates fumbling with your keys in a dark parking lot. Camaro's driver-oriented instrument panel has standard backlit gauges that are easy to read, even at night. Your speedometer is calibrated in both miles and kilometers per hour. To the right of the speedometer dial are the odometer and the resettable trip odometer. To the left of the speedometer is the tachometer, which monitors engine speed. Next to the tachometer and speedometer are a number of gauges and indicators. At the left are battery voltage and oil pressure gauges. Above these gauges are a check gauges light, pass key 2 security light, a parking brake light, a low track light, which indicates when the anti-lock brake system is operating, and a service engine soon light. A light to indicate your airbag system is functioning properly is located in the face of the speedometer, and a seatbelt reminder light is in the face of the tachometer. At the right of the instrument panel are engine temperature and fuel level gauges. A low oil light is located below the speedometer and a light to indicate ABS is functioning properly is below the tachometer. If any of your warning lights, indicators, or gauges seem to signal a problem, refer to your owner's manual, and if necessary, take your Camaro to your dealer for service as soon as possible. You'll find your owner's manual in a leatherette portfolio. It's easy to read with full-color illustrations and color-keyed subject indexes. Your portfolio also contains the warranty and assistance information booklet and the tire warranty booklet. For full details on all of your new car's service and maintenance features and requirements, 
please refer to the maintenance schedule included in your owner's manual. Your warranty coverage is detailed in the warranty and owner assistance booklet. It also explains a two-step customer satisfaction procedure to help resolve any concerns you might have. Included in your portfolio is information about Chevrolet roadside assistance. If you're ever stranded in your Camaro, a qualified Chevrolet representative can give you advice about minor repairs or arrange for towing service and alternate transportation. They'll also help locate a locksmith or a service company to change a tire or bring gas. The call is toll free. For assistance, call 1-800-CHEV-USA any time of the day or night, every day of the year, including holidays and weekends. To fully enjoy and preserve the investment in your new automobile, please read all of the information supplied in your portfolio. I think this is the end of side one. Once again, congratulations on your purchase of a new Camaro. If you have any questions or comments about your new car, we'd like to hear from you. You can reach us at 1-800-222-1020, the Chevrolet Owner Assistance Hotline. Now, please listen to part two of this program for information about your sound system. Wow, just immediately after they stopped talking, we're at the end of the music. Wow, it's awesome. Okay, so that's going to be it. That's, that's it for side one of this 1994 Chevrolet Camaro audio cassette. I just, I guess that this was like 1994 and I was correct, so I'm glad I knew that, so. Anyway, viewers, um, yeah, there's some hair piece on it. So anyway, viewers, that's going to be it for this video on, uh, side one of this 1994 Chevrolet Camaro cassette. Um, side two, we will have the selected options and features for that. Um, hopefully, side two is like hopefully side two for this nineteen ninety four Chevrolet Camaro. Like hopefully, it's similar to the ones you know from the nineteen ninety five Chevrolet cassettes. You know the ones with the gray covers. Hopefully, they're very very identical. So, anyway, viewers, I'll see you guys in the next video. This is Colton Tackett on Sonic Boom Fan One on One signing off. I meant to say Sonic and Okay, Kia Fanatic 2020. Sorry, this is Colton Tackett on Sonic and Okay, Kia Fanatic 2020 signing off. <laughs> Peace.